Okay, I'm going to show you how to change the oil on a push mower. Uh, I have a Craftsman push mower, but I'm sure they're all pretty much the same. This is what you're going to need. You're going to need a pan to drain the oil in, a funnel, some rags or paper towels, and mine takes 30 weight oil. And I'm going to show you a trick. I use a piece of my wife's, that's like press and seal she uses. I'm sure you could just use some plastic wrap or something, but. Alright, just take the press and seal. I'm putting that over the gas cap. I'm going to flip this upside down and you don't have to do that, but if you don't, it's going to leak gas out. Pull your dipstick, put that aside, put your pan here, Okay, while that's draining, I uh, might as well clean the bottom of my push mower off and sharpen my blades. Take this off. Mine takes a 9 16th inch socket. I'm using an impact wrench. You could also use a, a socket, just regular socket or a wrench. But if you're using a wrench or a socket, a regular socket, you're going to have to stick a board in between. Like put a board right here and there. Sure. Just like that, so this blade don't turn. Alright, this is how I like to sharpen my blades. I just clamp them to my workbench and I use a grinder. You could use a file. Uh, you could use, just use your bench grinder if you have a bench grinder.
Okay, after you get done sharpening them, you're going to want to maybe put a screw or a nail in the side of your workbench or you could put that nail or screw just on your on a vise or something, but you're going to want to check the balance of them. Make sure they're still balanced out. If one side's heavier than the other, then you're going to want to take a little bit off. All right, I got the blade sharp. And make sure you don't put it on upside down. I guess when you take it off, make sure you pay attention to the way you're taking it off. My craftsman is going to go back on with this curved side facing down, not facing up. be done draining. So let's flip her over and put some oil in it. takes about 20 ounces. Okay, I hope this video helped you. Uh, please like and subscribe. Um, just click on my picture right down in the corner of, my, of this video. That'll help, help me out. Thanks.